Ladies and gentlemen, game number two of this best of two between Cloud and Zimic. Cloud trying to secure the three points. Zimic trying to get the draw in one point. For Zimix, Gearing, Daring, Des Moines, Marseille, Moskva, Brisbane, Des Moines, Ohio, Ohio. For the side of Cloud, Kleber, Kleber, Stalingrad, Salem, Marseille, Salem, Marseille, Schlieffen, and a St. Vincent. Interesting, way different lineup. Some stuff I like. I, I go back and forth on if I like Schlieffen on this map, first off, because of the fact that Schlieffen is, um, it can be really good, but it can also be a problem. So, <laughs> as you go in here and look, ladies and gentlemen, um, heavy push for the side of Cloud towards C. They're sending the Kleber to fast cap A, but everything else is right now heading this way on the map. Uh, Schlieffen's going this way, but still, that's not a lot. For the side of Zimix, looks like a more even split. Five towards A, four towards B. Expect to see this Des Moines probably post up somewhere here, here to monitor this cap. But we'll keep an eye out and see how it goes from there. Still anybody's game this early on. So, Kleber's both early out for Cloud. They want to grab those A and C caps early on, and they're in a very strong spot to do it. Nothing else is even close because there's no fast French DDs on the side of Zimix. So you'll see those early... You'll see those early cap claims there because there's not going to be a way to contest. I mean, you might see... You might see the Brisbane try for the radar as he gets to the edge, but he's still too far away, and this cap is ticking quickly. This cap is ticking quickly. B, C is capped, A is capped. Points go up for the side of Cloud. Now, the Kleberts are going to back out, and at least at A, that cap will be claimed fairly quickly. There's no way they can hold it with just a Schlieff and a Kleber, a Kleber. But this is worrisome here if you're the side of Zimix. Double Salem with Super Heal if they can play the trade off right with the Stalingrad is just going to be brutal. Now keep an eye out. That Des Moines is going to spot this fairly soon. And so when he spots this, he spots both Salem's, and both Salem's are running radar. But when he spotted both Salem's, he doesn't know about the Stalingrad yet, but there's the radar forced out from Salem of Maximus. So you've now, in return for a Hydro that'll still last longer, you've forced out the location of both Salem's. And now here comes the push into A. Yes, it's given them a 100-point lead, and probably a little bit more, to be fair. Ooh, Cherny, not feeling too hot right now, already down 17,000 health. But now it comes the question of how quick can the side of Zimix push over. Schlieffen has the danger of the fact that the Schlieffen, with limited DCPs and heals, can die really quickly if you get the fight. If you get the fires. Kleber there takes a fire, running away right now. Hasn't popped the DCP yet. Probably there's the DCP. Um, just right on timing. He will dodge all those shots. 
Now the Des Moines of uh, Chernaja, and I'm sure I butchered that going, but this is the danger of the Salem. Salem can heal, but when you take AP damage from an Ohio, it may not make a difference. And look at this, the Des Moines about to finish this. Des Moines about to finish, but watch what's going to happen here. Oh my goodness, that Schlieffen's about to get smashed. Yeah, there we go, 18k. And the reload boosters. Down already, 26k. The Des Moines can radar at any time he wants and spot a lot of the stuff. Now he just has to win the fight here. De Schlieffen has not used the uh, DCP yet, so the Des Moines trying to get that DCP forced out. Because in the long run, Des Moines doesn't feel great about taking this fight at the health pools right now. The fire there helps, because now the Schlieffen is at 51k and dropping. There's the DCP forced. And so the Des Moines just wants to keep sitting there and keep putting shells out. As long as the Schlieffen's spotted, and there's the radar, and look at this. He's going to have 25 seconds of time not spotted after he finishes here. And the Salems of Cloud are stuck. Points lead is just about 110. And Schlieffen puts 8k into the nose of the Des Moines. But the problem is Schlieffen. Fire, 19 seconds. And I'm sure he's losing some of those secondaries as this HE continues to pound in on him. And this is why you want to, if you're a newer player, look at how the Des Moines is spreading the shots. He's got the fire in the mid. Now he's taking the chance to saturate this bow in here. So all the shots in on the bow, trying to saturate. You can see it's starting to get saturated, but also get the fire up there. He hasn't gotten the fire yet, but now this Schlieffen is gone. It's just a question of time at this point. And really much better start from the side of Zimix this time. Your Des Moines is probably going down at some point here in trade due to the fact that this push over here is happening and your Brisbane's almost gone. But the Des Moines, even if he goes down, trading out a Des Moines for the amount of damage you've gotten on the Salem's, one Salem already maxed out at 39,000 health. Des Moines does go down to the Schlieffen secondaries. But you've got that comboed with the fact that this Schlieffen just went down to the Marseille. And the amount of damage you've put on the Salem's. You're still down 110 points, but you've cleared out that battleship. And the Kleber is now down 9k. And so this push is coming into the center. Zimix needs to be able to pull these ships out. To be able to continue this. And this Stalingrad now, just getting focused. Can't even DCP, so ticking down... And the health pool slowly dropping. And also, look at these torps. Marseille is going to take one. He can't dodge them. And so the Marseille of UMD down to 57,000. And that's basically all unhealable. Zimix really fighting to get this, uh, the draw here. They're really fighting to get this draw here. St. Vincent does get the Brisbane up north, so that's an advantage briefly for Cloud. Huge chunk off the Salem. And yeah, I can heal some of that, but the fact that that's not the Salem that was knocked down to 39k, and this is going to bring him to maybe a max of 25, and now that Salem is lined up for another shot from the Marseille. Marseille really could have used the uh, reload booster there. There's the reload booster. But yeah, so you got a Stalingrad at 40,000, you've got a Salem at 38,000, or 30,000, you got a Salem at 39,000. The only downside here is the lack of... Oh! And that brings that Salem down to a max of about 15k. The only downside is that because the damage is spread out, you're not getting ships off the map yet. But Zimix has put a really good play in this game. The Stalingrad of BS Squirrel is going to be the next thing to go out. The Des Moines and the Moskva are going to be able to finish him. Even with... Because that Stalingrad's moved up. He has the DCP ready. He pops the DCP. And here come the broadside shots in, and the Ohio deletes him from 20 kilometers away. Lead back to only 110 for the side of Cloud, but it feels a lot worse than that, like I said, because you got Salem almost gone. Other Salem, 39k, and as soon as that daring moves forward and spots them, there we go. 
Salem of Maxima spotted, and here come the shots from the Ohio. Does he get another delete? He does get another delete, and now Zimix has brought that lead down to just 10. And now the Salem of Charge starts getting worked on. Zimix in strong control here. We look at the map from this perspective. Look at where they've got all of them. Out of their remaining ships, five of them stuck in this little grid right here. Yes, you've got the Kleber down here not spotted, keeping the Marseille spotted. But the Des Moines and Moscow push into B. That means dead Marseille. Ohio's have the shots on the St. Vincent. That Vincent's not going to last very long. If he's not careful. And that Marseille is now trapped. Because if that Marseille backs up, he gets run by both Ohio's. And right now, he's still dealing with Moskva and Des Moines in a position to get him. Daring spots the Kleber. Daring opens up on the Kleber. Egg Runner looking for the kill. And he's got that Kleber dead to rights. The Kleber goes down, only gets one salvo on the Daring. Daring will go down here. They will trade him out because of the fact that he is in the radar range. Which will keep the lead at 10 points. But now the Des Moines takes B and Zimix is on the hunt. This Marseille, like I said, he is not long for this world. This is really, at this point, Zimix's game to lose. Marseille can't back up, because the Ohio right there. Des Moines and Moskva are just set up there. They just need to be careful of your Zimix that you don't let the Moskva get uh, gunned down. Because you do have the Salem now starting to go up, because if you get the Moskva gunned down, that does put your Des Moines of sure in a rough spot. Marseille down here, Shadow of Mordor. Can't spot anything else because the Colbert is spotting him. St. Vincent does have the heals left. Like I said, this is just the slow but sure execution of Cloud's team. Watch even. Look at Tote. Tote's guns, fully ready to hit the Marseille. Moskva, still in a danger, but now the Salem goes in and the Des Moines has the advantage on the Salem because that Salem's inability to heal. Salem can't go higher than basically what he's at right now, so it doesn't matter, and the Marseille is at 15k and popping out. If Haguro goes down, which there is a decent chance he does, your hope is that they manage to kill the Marseille, and actually, Marseille is gone here. He doesn't have the DCP ready, um, and so it being at 6300, Des Moines gets one salve on him, it doesn't matter if the Moskva dies. Oh, but here come the shots from the other Ohio. And there goes the Marseille, and now the Des Moines can stream full forward. Moskva of Herguro goes down, balances it briefly, but now the Salem of Charge, using that last heal, doesn't matter. Shots come in, down to 6,600. And the only hope here, honestly, for the side of Cloud, as you look at these ships, is the Kleber. They know where the Kleber is if you're Zimix, but you can't do much to it. Um, you're going to take the chance to try to get the one salvo in. You're going to get the salvo in as he comes forward. You get him down to half health. The only hope, though, is that Salem. Uh, like, you, Colbert doing work. Because the Salem's going to go down. And the Marseille of Shadow has a 25,000 health lead on Cursed. And Cursed, Toterkopf looking for another kill. Gets the first chunk. Doesn't get the second one to hit. So we'll keep an eye out. Des Moines... Getting slapped by that Kleber doesn't feel good. Des Moines moving forward, though. 2,000 left on the Salem. It's like I said, as soon as that Salem spot, he's gone. Salem spotted. Can't quite hit him around the thing. Kleber gonna lace the shells in from the side. Not getting the damage he needs. Ooh, Des Moines doesn't get the damage he needs either yet. There's the hits. There's the fire. No DCP. That'll bring him down to just a thousand. Man, Des Moines Everything is really just not getting those shells where he wants. And there's the kill onto the Salem. And so that'll bring the lead to 250 points and all three caps. And the Marseille of Curse Suffering goes down. Zimix is a minute away from getting a much needed draw. And the St. Vincent, St. <clears throat> Vincent doesn't have a, a heal. He doesn't have a DCP. He's gone. And ladies and gentlemen, that'll do it. Zimix is going to claim this game. St. Vincent will be dead here before he even gets a uh, heal off.
In come the shots. De La Vega gone. Points lead up to 956. Tempest knows it's over. And ladies and gentlemen, Zimix will force the draw. And they needed that. They needed that. This keeps their chances of moving forward and becoming one of the top three teams alive. For Cloud, you're still possibly in the third spot right now, but you have work to do to be able to get more going. Ready, but, but there you go, ladies and gentlemen, the winner and bring the series to a draw, as we said, is the team of Zimmicks.